Hey guys, and welcome back to another video. Dad, international break is finally over. However, Ipswich at home, what are you thinking? Oh, thank heavens, the bloody break's over, Dan. You know, looking back to the support in the boys. You know, something, Dan, I don't know why. I don't know why. Albion 4, Ipswich 2. And by the way, big shout out to our mate, Big Kenny. Kenny, Kenny. I've spoke to you for a while, mate. Still love you. Come on, the baggies. Now then, come on, what's your score prediction? I think it's going to be a really tough game, Staff. Well, look, we should, we should have the advantage of being at home, but Ipswich, we all know they love a goal. They have so many goals and they're a really good team under Kieran McKenna. Um, but I'm going to go They just for, play open. Sorry to put it in. They don't play open, expansive football, don't they? And I think we could... Yeah, I'm going to go for... A 3 1 win. I feel like players like Dean Gunny to step up today. Oh, wouldn't it be good if we fired on all cylinders today? You know what was interesting? I think it was uh, yesterday me watching the Matt Phillips on the Albion Boys. Big shout out to them. I know the Albion channel. Um, I think it was, uh, he said about people go and notice in games. And there's Brandon Thomas Asante. And we've said it all the time. I think his work does go unnoticed. Yeah, I do. I, I think it's because he's, 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 he's supposed to be a striker and he's supposed to get the goals. But his work rate and work ethic is, is just second to none. But you know something? I'm looking forward to it. I've got the juices flowing. Cardiff on Tuesday night as well. Oh, yeah. But listen, come on, you baggies! What time is it? It's showtime! Well, good evening. Strange time for a quick kickoff. We've got Adam and Ellis. Well, can we call you Tractor Boys? You can call us Tractor Boys. So, like, yeah. So listen. So what time did you set off? Things come down here. We set off at one o'clock this afternoon. So so what to be fair. We'll be back in about three hours. So what's the kickoff after? So close to midnight, something like that. Maybe. So then, how long have you been supporting your Twitch fans? I've been supporting it since since the. Of course, it's the 90s. Wow. So I tell you and what. It's through the glory years of the Champions playoff and all that. Oh. Barnsley beating Barnsley at Wembley. You know, Sim, they're, they're a magical times. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to embarrass myself and show my age. I was brought up with Bobby Robson, at, uh, yeah. Nick Mills, Paul Mariner, Paul Cooper in goal. Uh, and I think we had a couple of these play for the hour. But listen, over the time that you've been associated with Ipswich, who's been your favourite manager? Oh. I think I've got to say George Burley. George just Burley is a us. name, are you? Yeah, just because oh, that like that. final. George Burley. He got us a season in the Premier League, got into Europe, didn't we? That's you remember? It. Do you hear that thing, George Burley? <laughs> he likes George <laughs> Burley, yeah. yeah. We were close to Champions League that year. That's what I remember. Well. Yeah, I remember Last it well. Last season, I remember it very, very well. Obviously, we'd better get the next season. Do you remember, great season what, what, for that. Do you remember during the days under Roy Keane? Yeah. Good or bad? Terrible. Oh no! Terrible. Yeah, terrible. Oh, now, now, yeah, then I, I shouldn't, <laughs> shouldn't roll on like this, but it's going to have to. So, Do you remember Alex Bruce? Yeah, I remember Alex Bruce. Good or yeah. bad? He was indifferent. Oh, no, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, I thought that. I thought that. Yeah, he was okay. So yeah, go on then, because okay. you have had a lot of England internationals in your time. That's a good player. Favorite standout? Well, favorite player to begin. Yeah. Favorite but, town player ever. Ever. Well, ever, ever. Dead or alive? Okay. I'd prefer to say Kieran Dyer. You forget about Kieran yeah, Dyer? Yeah, he you? burst on the scene. What? Scored with broken legs and things like that. He was, he was what brilliant. What a trip down memory lane. Can yeah. we ask Ellis who his favourite player is? Yeah, player you is? can. Ellis, sorry to bother. What you, what you give your burger out of 10? What would you say? 5 out of 10? Or you can say, Dad? 8 out of 10? 8 out of 10. Out of 10. Out of 10. Yeah. Very good. Wow. Dan always says 6 out of 10. <laughs> I'm sorry to bother you. So what would you say is your favourite Ipswich player? What was it? Amari Hutchinson. Amari Hutchinson. Amari Hutchinson. Yeah. Yeah. But yeah, we were talking about that earlier. He's exciting, that guy. So, how do you think your season's going so far? Because I like your man. It's brilliant. And it's yeah. a lot better than we probably would have hoped for or expected, to be honest. You know yeah. something? It seems to have galvanised everybody together, don't it? The whole, Even the local area. Local area. Everyone, the new owners who have got involved as well, they're chucking money into the ground, surrounding areas. It's what you want, isn't it? Training ground they're going to redo wow. and things like that. So they are invested in foundations. That's what you want to hear, don't you? So we feel, and that sounds cliche, like we've got a cut back, to be honest with you. Now, I don't want to go, to feel. I don't yeah. go and spoil it, because I know I'll let you go in a minute, because time's getting on. Yeah. But if, if you could have a, a, literally sit down with the owner and ask him one question, what would it be? Where do you see this club in five years' time? You know, that everybody says that. <laughs> no, I think it's not a cop out. I think it's brilliant. Yeah, and I, Go on. Go on. I think their model, <laughs> our model, is a Brighton. It's a blueprint garden, isn't it? Yeah, I think it is. Yeah. I think you've got a good set of. You know, Premier League, consolidate, then, then Europe eventually. Oh, oh, wouldn't that be brilliant? I can't wait to come to, uh, to come to Portman Road. So, go on, now you've been nice, and we'll start, we'll start with Dad first. 
It doesn't matter what, you've got to say from the heart. What's your prediction for tonight? You say it from the heart, you're running Femi in the slice. 2 1 town. Golf scores? George Hurst and Brendan Williams. You know, some I was all, Williams. I was all right until he's confidently <laughs> said that. <laughs> <laughs> Ellis, what do you think? What, what do you say is your score prediction tonight? 3 2. Three, two. Yeah, Can we give nice. one goal score in front of you, Tommy? Well, I like that. I like that. Hey, listen, thank you for stopping. Enjoy the game. We're going to see Here we are. And here is the big dog with Peaky Blinders on today. Oh. Here we are. That would have been the victory support today. That's a fantastic away support, that is. Considering it's a long journey game. Come on, you baggy boys. I'm still sticking on the 4-2. 
It's showtime. It's showtime. The shot, Jets. Go. Go. On. Yeah. It's two now. Come on, the ball. Pretty and Ghana. That is a peach of a goal, Dan. It was indeed. Diagana, oh! Diagana, baby! Diagana, oh! Dad, do you know what you're thinking? Quick start again. Oh, it's vintage Albion, everything come, come on, on there. That's that Albion at its best, Dan. At their best, rather. Hey, the men, the quiet waters go. Lord's my shepherd. He makes me down so light in pastures green. He laid of me the quiet waters by. Say that you need me, always be mine. Cause we got Carlos Corbran. Carlos Corbran, we've got. Oh, hold on. Be another. Blue and white, we're walls of sight, we're out until we die. Still going, Dad? Fantastic away support, Dan. They're only getting back to past midnight, you know. Fair play to and proper supporters. He's great in Ghana, Dad. Excellent performance. Absolutely brilliant. Hey, no, Kyle Bartley, Hey! 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 Play the captain's role. Fair play to the Ipswich fans, Dan. They sang throughout, okay. Two were pretty poor, but fair play to the long journey home. Good luck to Rhys Pimmy. What am I to Rhys at the moment? All of us still are sure that he'll be up there and sit. He'll be up there, there. He's a good manager, Dan. Good young manager. But today is our day. That was what you call a complete performance. A late kickoff. What are you thinking, my mate? Well, we just don't play them today. I'm playing. Everything come good for us, didn't it? I'm really proud for the lads of you. Yeah. Think the promotion dream is on? Yeah. Well, I'm happy. It's been freezing, but the stuff on there has been red oh, hot. Right. So, listen. Sorry to butt in, but I know Finn's got loads of stuff. So, Finn, yeah. go on, what Finn. you got for us? No, I think say? it was a good performance. Really? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and what are you saying, Perry? Super, mate. Car, car, full teddy of them today. Brilliant. Everything Absolute seems super. to come off, didn't they? Yeah, I think they did work right. Everything, there was nothing. There was, you, could, you can't fault nobody. You can't. I'm just saying today. to Dan, you know, it, it, it's lovely to see everything come off. They were putting in the last kick, the heads, the blocks. Everything, even I dancing up to a man, they all done a good I job. I don't even think they had a shot on goal. They had one shot on goal, and that is very rare, yeah, isn't it? Yeah. Another clean sheet for the keeper. I'm going to shout Stop. this as loud as possible. You ready? It's, it's your time! time! <laughs> <laughs> 
Well, the guys, full time is Albion swim interested. I mean, from the start, but what performance that is. Dan, for me, that is the complete performance. I'm really chuffed, right, because Southampton, we should have got at least a draw, yeah, no, and the no. signs were there. The football we played today, and for a change, right, for a change, that everybody put a foot in, a head in. We were saying it, Dan, am I on the right side of Furlong and Wallace? Man, the matches for me, they, I thought they were ace. I thought, Dan, I thought Furlong had the best game I've seen him play, yes. and I'll be, on, be honest with you, I think that's the best team performance I've seen oh, for a very long time. Yeah. Everything not, come on. This could be just this could be just me, right? But I think Mo brings something different to the team. Yeah. I think his passing ability now for like today was a very composed performance from the boys against a real tough Ipswich side. Yeah, I am very, very pleased and onwards and upwards. I've got to be honest with you. I just felt good about today. I know it's yes. a good team and they're a good young man who block by everything come off and for exactly. once right even some of the refereeing decisions yeah. went our way when they should not. Overall, a great, great performance. I'm so proud of him. And I'll tell you what, the man who has the credit for that, Carlos Corbin. Yeah, exactly, Corbin. he's got it already. Guys, big shout out to Ipswich fans. I thought they were ace, actually, today. I thought they yeah. were brilliant. Come a long, long way. All the best then for us this season. Dan, make sure to like, subscribe, and peace. Anything else to say? It's your time.